mr president i am minded actually to quote the great american philosopher murray rothbard here that the state the state is an institution of theft writ large. tax is just about a system where politicians and bureaucrats steal money from their citizens to squander in the most disgraceful manner. this place is no exception. fascinatingly and i really do not know how you manage to keep a straight face when you are talking about tax evasion the whole commission and the commission bureaucracy avoid their taxes. you do not pay taxes like citizens pay taxes. you have all sorts of special deals composite tax rates uh, high tax thresholds non contributory pension schemes. you are the biggest tax avoiders in europe and here you sit pontificating. well the message is getting home to the people of the european union. you are going to find that eurosceptics are coming back in june in ever greater numbers in ever greater numbers and i can tell you worse as the people get your number it won't be long before they storm this chamber and they hang you and they'll be right. now um on behalf of the Europe of Freedom and Democracy, for two minutes, Mr. Bloom. Uh, thank you. Uh, Mr. President, I wonder if you'll permit me to gallop through the working day of the average Englishman. He wakes up and he turns on his taxed telly to get the news. He leaves his heavily taxed house, gets in his heavily taxed car, he fills it with heavily taxed diesel. He gets to work to earn an income which, after income tax, employer and employer national, employee national insurance, a third of his income has disappeared. A third. He drives home and stops on the high street for a few articles for the house. His purchases are taxed at 20%. He calls in for a pint, over two thirds of the cost of which goes in tax. He dreams of a family holiday abroad, but he can't afford the airport tax. He longs for the day that he can retire, but the politicians won't let him go. We must steal his savings, mustn't we? The financial transaction tax. The poor sap doesn't even know we've nicked it. Of course, with the Commission, top salaries, income tax free, non contributory pension schemes, it's difficult for you, isn't it, to imagine his distress? Because you're not in this game, are you? You're not in this game. You don't pay any of this. You don't pay any of this. On a more technical note, perhaps I can pick up, Mr. President, I draw the House's attention to my own Lunatic Committee's Amendment 39 to Article 4B, the withdrawal of legal title to untaxed transactions ever, anywhere in the world. Sugar in the petrol tank, if you will. We're very much looking forward to the vote. We're watching to see which imbeciles commend it. I suspect it will be the same usual parliamentarian flat earthers. Thank you, Mr. Bloom.